Hello, my name is Mary D, and welcome to my YouTube channel, Mary D Plays. In this video, I'm doing the Fender Play app, random exercise and riff that is sent to my phone five days a week, Monday through Friday, and I'm on acoustic classical guitar. Uh, today's random exercise is A, C sharp, minor, D, and E chords, and A with finger picking. I probably won't be finger picking now. Probably just be using a guitar pick. And uh, today's random uh, riff is You Are My Sunshine. Apparently I've done it before. Uh, this one has update feedback mode. So, which I haven't done yet. So that's something to look forward to. I'd be curious to see what kind of feedback that Fender gives me, or at least their Fender Play app gives me. All right, let's uh, do this. So with the exercise, it says apply a finger picking pattern to a simple progression in A. And here's the chords that apparently are being used today. And of course there's a bar chord, <sighs> bar chords. Okay, so there's an A chord, which, you know, I know, already know how to do. Ah, C sharp minor chord. Okay, that's what, fourth fret. One, two, three, four. That sounds really crappy. D chord and the E chord. Tabs are okay. There are the tabs. Pretty sure I've done this before. It looks familiar. All right. Play. Let's check out an exercise with a feet. All right, let's refresh uh, because uh, the green flashing screen hurts my eyes. Sometimes you have to refresh the video. Might be a good thing because it sounds like uh, the fire department's busy. I live right down the street from two different fire departments on in either direction. And one sounds like they're busy. Okay, let's see. Let's play this. Let's check out an exercise with a finger picking ah, it's pattern. Still doing on it. A one, three. Yeah. Mm. Hopefully this fixes it. Sometimes I have to shut down all the browsers. Okay. Let's check out an exercise with a finger picking ah. pattern on a one, three, four, Come five. On. Really? Let's check out an exercise with a finger picking pattern on a one, three, four, five chord progression in the key of A. Here's how it sounds. hand we have four chords let's check them out and make sure that we know where the root notes are first chord we have a that's our one chord the root note is on the open a string our three c sharp minor the root is on the a string fourth fret our four chord d root note is on the open d string our five chord e the root is on the open low e string let's check out the progression we have one bar of a Followed by C sharp minor, full bar there. Our third bar, D, and our last bar, E. In the strum hand, we have a one bar eighth note based finger picking pattern. Let's go ahead and walk through that pattern on an A chord. 
the thumb will plug the root note, in this case the open A string, the index on the G string, middle finger on the B, ring on the high E. We're going to play this pattern. P, A, M, I, P, M, I, A. And we're going to play straight eighth notes. One, and, two, and, three, and, four, and. I remember the root on the A chord is on the open A string. C sharp minor, root on the A string, fourth fret. D, root note on the D string, and the E chord, root note on the low E. And since the final note of each measure ends on a high E string, clean transitions between some of these chords may take a little extra practice. Be patient with yourself. Now let's put the entire exercise together and play it five times. We'll end with a whole note on an A chord. Get ready. I'll count you in. One, and two, and three, and four, and... Nice job. Now that you've got a hold on finger picking in the key of A, you could try it in some other keys. Happy practicing. See you later. Okay, I'm going to play it again and play along. Let's check out an exercise with a finger picking pattern on a one, more enlarged three, taps. four, five chord progression. This is like easier with this. Here's how it sounds. Yeah. We have four chords. Let's check them out and make sure that we know where the root notes are. First chord, we have A. That's our one chord. The root note is on the open A string. Our three, C sharp minor. The root is on the A string, fourth fret. Our four chord, D. Root note is on the open D string. Our five chord, E. The root is on the open low E string. Let's check out the progression. We have one bar of A. C sharp minor, full bar there. Our third bar, D. And our last bar, E. In the strum hand, we have a one bar eighth note based finger picking pattern. Let's go ahead and walk through that pattern on an A chord. The thumb will pluck the root note, in this case, the open A string, the index on the G string, middle finger on the B, ring on the high E. We're going to play this pattern P, A, M, I. P, M, I, A. And we're going to play straight eighth notes. One, and, two, and, three, and, four, and. I remember the root on the A chord is on the open A string. C sharp minor, root on the A string, fourth fret. D, root note on the D string. And the E chord, root note on the low E. And since the final note of each measure ends on a high E string, clean transitions between some of these chords may take a little extra practice. Be patient with yourself. Now let's put the entire exercise together and play it five times. We'll end with a whole note on an A chord. Get ready. I'll count you in. One, and two, and three, and four, and...
second time. Nice job. Now that you've got a hold on finger picking in the key of A, you could try it in some other keys. Happy practicing. Okay. See you later. I want to play this on my own because obviously I'm not up to the speed yet. I'll get there. So. Moving on to the random riff. You Are My Sunshine. So You Are My Sunshine became an official state song of Louisiana since it was sung by country singer and state governor Jimmy Davis. Interesting. I didn't know he was a governor at one time. Learned something new. Okay, the information about in You Are My Sunshine by Jimmy Davis, you will play a riff with a single note picking based off the vocal melody. By the end of this lesson, you will have learned single note down picking. And here is the tabs for the song. It will play this. Let's learn the riff from You Are My Sunshine by Jimmy Davis. It's eight bars long and then mix the vocal melody adapted for guitar. It sounds like this. Let's work through this. We start with two open G's followed by fret two on the G string. So, you are my. We move to three open B's. Sunshine, my. Then fret two on the G string, back to open B. Only. Then two open G's. Sunshine. Moving on, we have another open G, fret two on the G, then open B. You make me. Then fret one on B and open E. Happy. Then we walk down. When skies are gray. Or zero three one zero. For you'll never know, dear. We have open G, 
fret 2 on G, open B, fret 1 on B, and high E. You'll never know, dear. Then walk down, open high E, fret 3 on B, fret 1 on B, open B, then open G. Then the last phrase of our melody is open G, fret 2 on G, and open B. Please don't take, then fret 1 on B, and fret 2 on G twice. My sunshine. And the last two notes are open B and open G. Away. For our strum hand, you can play all down strums for this melody. And if you know your rhythms, you'll notice that we play a lot of these melodies starting on the and of three. So, one and two and three. You are my sunshine. Same thing right here. My only sunshine. So, one and two and three. You make me happy. Same here. One and two and three. And skies are gray. Two, three. You'll never know, dear. Same thing here. One and two and three. How much I love you. Now, this last melody starts on B4. So, we have one, two, three. Three, please don't take my sunshine away. Now that last note is a whole note, so make sure you hold it for four whole beats. Now let's play through the whole thing. Get set with your open G note, and I'll count us in. One and two and three. And that's the riff. Okay, go on, watch it again and play along. Also, go ahead and enlarge the tabs. This is a lot easier to read. Let's learn the riff from You Are My Sunshine by Jimmy Davis. It's eight bars long and mimics the vocal melody adapted for guitar. It sounds like this. Let's work through this. We start with two open G's followed by fret two on the G string. So, you are my. We move to three open B's. Sunshine, my. Then fret two on the G string, back to open B. Only. Then two open G's. Sunshine. Moving on, we have another open G, fret two on the G, then open B. You make me. Then fret 1 on B and open E. Happy. Then we walk down. When skies are gray. Or 0, 3, 1, 0. For you'll never know, dear. We have open G, fret 2 on G, open B, fret 1 on B, and high E. Then walk down, open high E, fret 3 on B, fret 1 on B, open B, then open G. Then the last phrase of our melody is open G, fret 2 on G, and open B. Please don't take, then fret 1 on B, and fret 2 on G twice. My sunshine. And the last two notes are open B and open G. Away. For our strum hand, you can play all down strums for this melody. And if you know your rhythms, you'll notice that we play a lot of these melodies starting on the and of three. So, one and two and three. You are my 
my sunshine. Same thing right here. My only sunshine. So one and two and three. You make me happy. Same here. One and two and three. And skies are gray. Two, three. You'll never know, dear. Same thing here. One and two and three. How much I love you. Now this now last this melody starts, last on, melody B4. starts on B4, so we, have one, so we have one, two, two three. three. Please don't take, don't take my sunshine away. Now that last note is a whole note, so make sure you hold it for four whole beats. Now let's play through the whole thing. Get set with your open G note, and I'll count us in. One and two and three. And that's the riff. And that's the riff. Okay. Now I'll go ahead and go in practice mode. do that again. I had kind of a delayed intro. Let's try one more time. For some odd reason, I'm coming in late on the intro. This has what a feedback mode. Remember, serves me. Yeah, I did. Okay, first I want to do a review and play along with the review. Um, this doesn't get recorded. This just shows me how they're going to play it. feedback mode. Thank you. 
Uh, thought I did pretty good. As soon as I missed some notes. That might not be correct. I didn't think I missed any. But, hmm, that's interesting. All right, I'm going to try it again. better but I, I know I screwed up hmm right, let me see if it marked where because I know where I screwed up let's see if it shows it mm -hmm. it does see where it has a red right there but then it has right up there I don't think I missed it okay but right there yeah that's where I screwed up all right so I go through and do the feedback one last time I know I screwed up. Let's see. Yeah, it did mark where I screwed up at, except up there. I didn't think I screwed up. Hmm. All right. 